My dear child, today I come to offer you peace and calm. I saw your tears yesterday. Because of that situation, we both know well, but I am here to remind you that I am always watching over you, and not a single hair falls from your head without my knowing. So today, I assure you that you will overcome the trial you think you cannot bear, and you will do so victoriously and with your head held high. I am here to ease the burden on your shoulders. First, however, I will provide the strength you seek and let you experience my profound love, ensuring your spirit remains resilient and your faith firm. Open your heart wide. Allow my words to flow into you freely and let them transform every aspect of your being. I understand you have faced tough days and felt overwhelmed. Just open your heart and welcome my message. I will boost your strength and prolong your life. I also wish that every morning when you wake up, you feel wrapped in divine happiness, empowered with strength, dispelling your doubts, filling you with peace and helping you see the beautiful blessings you will receive today. My goal is to give you the courage to face life boldly and to trust in my willingness to bless you. Fear not. I do not ask for your possessions. My love is freely given. I do not demand a portion of your earnings to show you my affection. Instead, give me your gratitude and loyalty. Place me first in your life and home, so that my words may fill your hoose and everyone can hear my voice as I speak of my sweet love. Give me your life, your heart, let your eyes look forward to the paths that lead to blessings. Never turn away from me. Shun lies and wickedness and I will give you the best. I will surround you with abundance, provision, health and strength. If you dare to go against the flow and choose not to please this world of falsehood, if you open your heart to my truth, I will be your path, your peace, your shepherd, your Lord. My word will always be the light on your path. I will reveal where dangers hide, and I will confound your enemies. Fear nothing. You can do all things, for I strengthen you. I will bless you and remind you often, so you never forget. When troubles arise, may your first reaction be a beautiful emotion born from your sincere faith, for your soul already feels secure in my protection. Understand that problems do not come to destroy you, and life's battles cannot take away your truth. You are a child of God Almighty, the creator of the universe. I will never tire of speaking to you whenever I wish. I will touch the window of your soul, even in the early hours, whispering in your ears with this holy voice that resonates within you. You will come thirsty to dive into this spiritual river, drink from heavenly sources, and feast on the eternal word. You will never hunger or thirst. Your soul will be fulfilled, and you won't need the destructive vices and bad habits of this world to find joy. For I will be your joy, the fire burning in your heart, driving you forward. I will reveal to you what lies ahead tell you about the blessings waiting for you and transform your way of thinking and your character. I will take all your desires, wishes and plans into my hands and align them with my will so that every step you take, you walk in faith toward the realm of the supernatural. I am your light and your salvation. You should fear no one and nothing. I am the strength of your life. You are not a loser or a coward. You are stronger than you believe. In my holy name, you will triumph. Tell me you believe, and tomorrow, rise with faith, proceed with determination, for my angels are with you. Do not fear. Prepare for victory, my champion, for I am revealing to you who I am. Your path, your truth, your life, the peace, freedom, and hope you need today. 
I am your reason to live, your strength to keep believing, and the enthusiasm to keep moving forward. No matter what challenges you face today, no one and nothing can take away your faith, your determination to fight to the end, and your pursuit of me until you feel a piece of heaven here on earth. I love you so deeply, you don't need to be in heaven to feel my closeness. My Holy Spirit descends upon you like a gentle dove resting on your shoulders. As your heart listens, it whispers blessings, and you feel an immense joy as if you were soaring. There is no burden on your back. It's as though the clouds themselves are lifting you, guiding you through a field brimming with life and happiness. In the midst of your struggles and challenges, when enemies surround you and your emotions are tangled, close your eyes, and in the silence of your heart, my Holy Spirit will come again to comfort you, to ease your stress, to envelop you in peace, and to immerse you again in this beautiful serenity. This sacred place is where your miracles are born, where your sins are forgiven. Come by faith, take refuge under my protection. Here, your doubts and fears disappear as they encounter my light. Come whenever you wish, just turn your face to me. I'm listening. Even if you speak to me in a whisper, even if you feel so weary that all you can do is hand me your burdens and remain silent, here is your blessing. Here are all the answers to your prayers, the peace you long for. I'm your shepherd, and with great love I lead you to calm waters. Here you will find rest. It is time to dream. Don't worry about anything. You have given me your troubles, and I will take care of them. You will rise, and today you will walk in peace. And if you meet people filled with tension, if they speak harshly to you, respond with love, with a gentle word that calms anger and eases fury. The enemy flees when it sees that my Holy Spirit resides in your heart. Step by step, don't give up. Some will try to lead you away from this beautiful path, but you will keep walking and trusting, wrapped in my peace. You're no longer the person you once were. You're no longer enslaved by that anxiety. I came to give you a life filled with abundance for eternity. Do not be troubled by what you see. Focus on your blessings. Others may stray from the path because they have not let me into their hearts, but I am your light, guiding your decisions. Every darkness trying to cloud your mind is completely obliterated by my bright presence. I fill your entire being and there's no space for any feeling that pulls you back to the past and causes you pain. From now on, everything is about focus, courage, perseverance, victory, and blessing. I'm not making life easier for you. I'm simply granting you the inheritance that my word has already promised you. You are blessed with gifts from above, loved and accepted, cleansed and spotless, chosen for good works, sealed with a promise so you feel and believe that your hope does not diminish or weaken. Although years may pass and struggles continue, your faith grows ever stronger. Each day, you become more filled with peace and tranquility. Do not follow the paths where the crowds go. Come to me, and do not stray or listen to the advice of those who do not know me. Your victory is assured. You do not need to resort to lies or deceit, or seek the shortest or easiest way. I will bless you as I have promised. I am not human to fail you or lie to you. I am giving you authority over every principality and power. Your enemies will see you and flee. But you must be in the spirit and commit both body and soul to my word and my holiness. Do not rush into battle relying on your own strength. I am the one who gives you victory. Continue as you are praying, embracing my word, and each time you listen with closed eyes and an open heart, you will feel my tender embrace, my sweet, holy, and powerful love, a feeling so profound and beautiful that it fills your soul with joy and peace. I'm your true father. I have loved you. 
I love you, and I will continue to love you forever, my dear child. Today, I am giving you a new life. From now on, everything will change. Start this day with your head held high and your heart filled with faith. You will see that everything transforms gradually around you. Never forget, I am with you every moment of today, providing the strength you need to overcome each challenge and the sensitivity to appreciate all the beauty and small blessings I am offering you. Do not drift away from me and do not get caught up in the negativity of the world. Stay positive, even if everything around you seems to be falling apart. Just breathe in, my peace. Let your heart find rest, and remember that everything has a purpose, and I am your almighty God. I am aware of everything that happens. I am aiding you in tough situations and even in the small details. No detail escapes my notice. I give you my love, and I want you to show compassion to others, to love them, and to be patient with them. I want you to forgive them. Your attitude towards these people can lead many to come to me. Today, I'm giving you new strength to start afresh. I provide you with wisdom to resolve all your problems. Live this day with joy, because everything is already in my hands. I know all your troubles and your emotions. Just stay calm, keep faith, and strive to do your best. If you feel alone, don't be afraid, just pray, and you will realize that I have never left your side. My love for you and your loved ones is boundless. With these promises I give you, believe, trust, and chase your dreams, because I will make everything much better and easier than you can imagine. And when night falls, be thankful for everything you've experienced. Your gratitude matters, your attitude is powerful. Remember that, my dear child. I'm with you today, tomorrow, and always. I understand your situation very well, and I'm aware of the suffering you endure. Your struggles are unique, and sometimes your emotions are tangled. But whenever you feel weak, hold on to my hand, and that's why you won't sink. Let me be with you in this time of hardship. I want you to embrace my word. I will heal your soul and take your pain away forever. You are right to say that many don't understand you, but I know everything you've experienced in the past, and I know what you are facing now. The people around you only see what's on the surface and don't realize that your heart is in pain. I do understand you and I want to help. I want to remove the burden that weighs you down and free you from the prison of anguish. I am breaking the chains that still make you a slave to the past. I will remove the blindfolds from your eyes so that you can see the future of goodness and peace I have prepared for you. Those who despise you and don't understand you will have to be left behind because they have rejected faith and no longer wish to walk with me. I will continue to love them, but they have strayed from the path. If you choose to continue by my side, you will need to distance yourself from them. Don't fear the path ahead. You will not be alone. I will provide you with shade from the hot sun and defend you with my mighty arm. An army of angels will march before you, clearing the way and protecting you from enemy attacks. Your life is about to change very soon, and you will be very glad you made the right decision. You were receptive when I touched your heart, and you opened the door to me. We will be together forever. Your pain will become a thing of the past, and your life will be filled with love and happiness. I will lavish my grace and kindness upon you. You will be immensely blessed. Everything will be different. I love you, and now is the time for your victories. Give me your hand. You deserve to be happy, and I want to bless you. I will surround you with courage and dignity. I will raise you up and bless you before those who once humiliated you. I will open the doors and windows of heaven for you to prosper greatly. Receive this word that refreshes your soul. 
My Holy Spirit breathes life into your heart. My power permanently destroys your burdens. When you face difficulties and feel weary, come seek refuge under my wings. There is no one else in this world who can offer you the pure, unconditional love that I do. I don't desire your material possessions. Grand offerings do not impress me. I protect and guard you simply because I love you, and I will care for you for a ver. I will always be watching over you. It is my will that you also learn to help others, become strong to protect the vulnerable, wise and prosperous, to provide for those in need. Step out in faith toward a level where supernatural miracles happen. Lay your hands on the sick so they may be healed. This is my will. Be free from financial burdens and have a dignified way to earn your living. Avoid debt. You don't need more worries. Do not become a slave to creditors. If you see someone in need, confidently extend your hand, speak my word and break the chains that bind people. Pray for their freedom. Help as many as you can. You might encounter angels along your path who will test your sincerity and greatly increase your blessings. You are entering a new life in a supernatural realm. Get used to witnessing miracles and using the authority I give you to confront the enemy. Pray daily. Come into my presence and ask for wisdom. Open your Bible, study Proverbs and Psalms, memorize what you read. Speak them aloud as I inscribe them on your heart. Feast on my word every day and learn something new. Admire the life of faith lived by my servants. Watch for signs of the end times, but do not argue about my promises. Show your faith through your trust in me. Dare to extend your hand to the needy with genuine love and compassion. Please come and listen to me daily. Remember, I have already forgiven your mistakes and set you free. You are no longer under any curse or bound by any vice. I offer you holy freedom, wisdom, and supernatural insight. Listen to my voice whispering sweet words of love within you. Do not lose touch with me. Even on days when you don't feel like praying or talking, I will still come, knocking on the door of your heart, extending my hand, bringing peace to your soul, and surrounding your home with blessed calm. Accept this. You no longer live under the shadow of fear. The good and uplifting things you plan to do in my holy name, you will accomplish. I'm not talking about vain self-improvement or corrupt material success. It is written that you will also perform greater miracles because I have endorsed you from my heavenly throne. Do not fear success. Do not be ashamed to be victorious. The time for your victories has come. You deserve them. You have fought hard and shown your faith. It's time to step into my presence and receive the blessings I'm about to place in your hands. Tell me with courage that you truly believe in me. Rise with faith, because today I will bless you. I will give you strength. I will be with you. I will never leave you. I will test you. I will answer you. My word is in your heart. I will remind you every minute that I am always with you and you are never alone in this world of troubles. I command thousands of angels to protect your steps, to destroy the dangers lurking in the darkness. You should not fear, and if fear attacks you, rise again with firm resolve. Get used to walking with the attitude of a victor. Remember, my love for you grows every day. My sacrifice on the cross was to save you and give you life in abundance. I will give myself to you unreservedly. I'm always ready to listen to you, embrace you, and give you the peace you need. Fear not, for I will never abandon you. You are my precious treasure, and nothing and no one can separate you from my love. Rest. Stop worrying about your problems. Receive this holy peace. I embrace you and cover you with my grace. Your well-being and happiness are important to me. I'm here to listen 
and understand everything that is holding you back. Just remember, I will support you no matter what. If something is draining you or causing you discouragement, let me help you find a solution. My Holy Spirit resides in you, empowering you and giving you dominion over your emotions, enabling you to choose happiness. Do not seek happiness from any person. It is my will that you be free from emotional dependence. Do not fight sin and temptation with your own strength. Give me control of your thoughts, your spirit, your heart. Avoid situations that cause unnecessary tension. Guard your heart diligently. It is the wellspring of life. Stand firm and do not let the violent steal your joy. I want to be first in everything. Consult me before you take any steps or make important decisions and I will guide you so you don't fall into the traps of thieves or into the pits of the devourer. I want to impart wisdom to your family every day. It is my desire that they are blessed in every way just as they nurture their souls and give importance to my word, to prayer, and to speaking prudently so that words causing pain do not escape their lips. Do not entertain gossip or slander. Do not believe everything you hear. Be wary of those known for lying. Do not let anyone plant resentments and fears in you. Come into my presence. Bring me your situations, thoughts, and emotions. Stay attentive to me throughout the day. Feel my presence in your heart and mind. You will hear my guiding voice. Look around. Many people suffer and sadness marks their faces. But I want my glory to shine in you. For your courageous look to uplift many. You are my beloved son, my beloved daughter, my most precious creation. I have given you unique gifts and talents to use in my name and for my glory. Do not worry about the future because I have a plan for you. My love is unconditional and eternal. My plan is perfect and will unfold in its time. It's true that I want your heart and your eyes on my holy path. But I have known you since the creation of the universe and I know both your mistakes and your successes. If you fail, I seek your repentance. Come with faith and ask for forgiveness, and I will grant it. Do not seclude yourself in a dark room, mourning your sins, thinking your life is over and that I'm angry. I paid for your faults even before you knew me, so come confidently and with sincerity. I will give you another chance. Do not fear. Give me your worries that confuse your soul. You belong to me. You have entrusted your life to my care. My words are a healing for your soul. That's why I always speak to you with love and with the intention of guiding you on the right path. Leave your fears behind and trust in me. I'm your rock, your safe haven during storms. Each time you hear and share these messages, your confidence grows, your blessings increase, and your home fills with my love. I am your loyal friend, your protector. Come to me every day in sincere prayer, and I will strengthen your heart. I love you. I hold you in my hands. Here, I take care of you with love. I have never left you. Nothing bad will happen to you. Be attentive. You will overcome this situation. You are going through a tough time but it will soon end. Your sadness will turn into joy. I send showers of happiness to you in your worst storms. I have carried you in my arms, and when you feel like crying, I will be waiting for you. Release those tears you have been holding back. Tell me what you feel. I am listening. Remember this day I have loved you with an everlasting love, and with me you have the power to rise from the pit of sadness to fill your heart with joy only with me. You can and will be happy, even if today you face dark clouds of conflict. Believe in me, and let my word light up your path. Your enemies may say you will be defeated, but my word comforts you, and my assurance confirms it to you. Do not fear I'm with you. I'm strengthening your heart 
removing your anxiety and fear, healing your emotions, and filling you with serenity, peace, and supernatural strength, so that you may rise with great courage. I see you for who you truly are, strong, steadfast, intelligent, and wise. I am infusing you with spiritual encouragement. If you want to witness miracles and wonders, you must move forward. If you want to see walls crumble and chains break, you must continue. Keep praying, believing, fighting, persisting, and persevering. I grant you unbreakable strength and faith. But if you become discouraged, or when things don't go as planned, I will always be there to lift you up. My grace and mercy are everlasting. Do not limit my love or my forgiveness. If I chose you from your mother's womb, I also know all the challenges and difficulties you will face. I know that you love me, believe in me, and will seek me. You will not back down from the negativity you encounter during the day, from the threats and lies of the enemy, nor will you be afraid. If you believe that I love you, and if you know and feel with certainty that I'm real, also believe that a great blessing is coming your way. There is an eternal truth to which you must hold fast. I do not change, I do not lie. I am always the same. And if I have told you a thousand times that I love you, it's because I truly do. No matter what you face, I will never stop loving you. Many find this hard to understand. They prefer to believe lies. Many give up when they face obstacles. But you will not give up. You will not retreat. You will not stop. You will not turn back. You will not abandon your faith or my promises. That day after day you will hold on. Your life means so much to me. Just as I have helped you in the past, I will continue to help you today and every day. I will keep showing you how much I love you in many ways. You will have no doubt that I am always with you, looking after you, defending you, watching over you, meeting your needs, listening to your words, to your prayers, commanding my angels to act and make your requests come true. I am pleased to see your active faith, that you come and share your desires with me. Some may tell you not to seek me, just to ask for things, but I say, seek me with all your heart and I will take care of the rest. A time will come when you realize that even before you speak, I already know your needs well. It is never in vain when you ask me for something. I rejoice when I hear the beat of your faith. You know well that I love you and that I will answer you. What I appreciate most about you is your patience. You do not get frustrated when my response isn't immediate. You've learned to wait and trust that I will give you what will truly bless your life. Be courageous. I'm filling you with great strength. The times of sadness are passing, and joy will return to your life and home. You can serve me, share this word, and help extend this blessing to many souls today. I bless you for your pure and humble heart. Because of your faith, great and wonderful things are coming into your life. Here I am, waiting for you. Come tomorrow and tell me everything you feel and want to do. Bring your plans to my throne. And truly, I will bless you abundantly. My daughter, my son. I'm interrupting whatever you're doing because I want you to spend some time with me. I will calm your heart and organize your emotions. Let's talk about your life. I know you are concerned about the future and work hard, but you have your limits. It's time to rest. Close your eyes, breathe calmly, and let go of the anxiety that clouds your vision. Your internal struggles are overwhelming. You no longer know what to do, where to go, or whom to trust. Therefore, I urge you, it's time to return to your foundations. Remember where I brought you from, and notice how much you have changed and grown in many ways. Your faith and your wisdom have strengthened. There is a time for everything under this bright and beautiful sun. A time to work, to wait, 
to fight, to win, to receive rewards, and to enjoy blessings. There are also times of mourning and pain, where even bitter tears can heal the heart and revive the desires you once laid at my feet. Failure is not the end of your journey. My love for you never ends. If you've lost everything due to your own mistakes, know that I love you even more because I hold you in my hands. I'm now removing the invisible barriers that have kept you trapped in the same place for years. I'm revealing this because my love for you is deep. Beautiful, significant, and positive changes are coming into your life, even as the world becomes clouded with the turmoil of human conflicts. Focus on what you love, your health, education, preparation, and work. Invest your time in what builds your future. Invest your energy, your strength, and your life in seeking my presence every day to gain more prudence and wisdom. I want to align your vision with mine so that you can see what others do not see. The truly wise person avoids danger, while the foolish and distracted get involved in pointless conflicts and challenges, risking their lives and health for fame and fortune. They end up enslaved by sadness because they achieve nothing. As I have said in my written word, my blessing truly enriches spiritually, so much so that even your enemies seek peace with you and my prosperity surrounds you when others face scarcity and despair. You have a kind heart, and you will help those who lack clothing, shelter, and food. As you give to those in need, I will bless you and your family even more. Do you feel how you feel now? Wasn't this time of spiritual communion worth it? You feel happier, fulfilled, satisfied, and ready to continue your journey. I am also pleased and out of love for you. Now I choose to be silent. But my affection speaks to you, not with words. You can hear it when you close your eyes in faith and listen. Calmly, feeling and emotion flood your heart and bring tears to your eyes. Now you understand. I will never speak to you in shouts. Come, seek me in the solitude of your room. Just listen, stay silent and you will even feel the silence itself showing you how much I love you. Please, tell me that you love me too, and thus we conclude this moment of devotion with my blessing. Amen.